The wait is over. There are few bigger days on the football calendar than Champions League final day. Fans are beginning to pour into the stadium and the tension is palpable. It's Real Madrid and they take on Barcelona. It's coming up live next on EA TV. And here it is, the last lap in the season-long race for the trophy. Millions of viewers from around the world are tuning in for the biggest final in club football, the Champions League final. A warm welcome from me, Derek Ray, joined here on the commentary box, as always, by the former Arsenal and West Ham player, Stuart Robson. And with the atmosphere building to fever pitch, we're just minutes away from kickoff time. It's Real Madrid facing Barcelona. Well, Derek, it doesn't come any better than this, does it? This has the makings of an absolute classic. These are two brilliant teams, and at the moment, I can't separate them. Starting 11 for Real Madrid. Thibaut Courtois is the keeper of choice. Jude Bellingham starts with Toni Kroos in the centre of the park. And the main threat in attack today should be Kylian Mbappe. the starting 11 for Barcelona. Marc-André Ter Stegen stands between the posts. Frenkie de Jong plays alongside Ilkay Gundogan in central midfield. And leading the line today, Robert Lewandowski. This is it, the Champions League final. They are underway who will be crowned club kings of Europe. Lewandowski. Oh, that was a chance to give them an early advantage. Well, they should be off to a flyer here. And that was a poor effort. He must hit the target. Carvajal. Modric. And Valverde. And Real's creative tendencies coming to the fore. But they took care of the situation defensively. Mbappe. Now with Vinicius Jr. Vinicius! He's done it! What a moment! The opening goal in this Champions League final. And just look at the celebrations. Well, here we can see it again, and he does so well to skip beyond the defender. It just buys him that bit of time to get his shot away. That's a really nice goal. Barcelona restart the game. Will that goal have the effect of stinging them into action? Gundogan. Now with De Jong. And a strong tackle. Joao Cancelo. And Barcelona winning the ball back. Lewandowski. Carvajal. 
Wonderful challenge and a throw in coming up. Really inventive stuff from Real here. Is it going to be? Corner for Real Madrid. And a goal kick is the outcome. And unable to keep possession. Joao Felix. Oh, that's a pass of high quality. Oh dear, oh dear. Opportunity squandered, Stuart. Well, what a chance that was for the equaliser. You don't get too many better than that. Modric. This is Kroos. And a tidy tackle. What can Real do from this position? Well, offside anyway, albeit a tight one. Well, they're doing a fine job of applying pressure here, not giving their opponents time to think or get out of their own half. It did look on for them, but not to be. Gives it a go! Well, the keeper committed himself. And a short corner here. And the cross into the middle. Well cleared away. That's the kind of shielding play you expect from him. And he read it well defensively. Kunde. Here's Rafinha. Lewandowski. And nobody there to pick him up in the centre. Oh dear, oh dear. He went for placement. But a really tame effort, you have to say. Kamavinga. This is Kroos. A sloppy pass. Tony Kroos. Jude Bellingham. A really single-minded piece of defending to make sure nothing untoward happened. Well, inching towards half-time, Real Madrid hold the advantage. Stuart, what strikes you about their performance so far? Well, they've worked hard and played well to be in front here, but they now need to keep their focus as we approach half-time. Rafinha. Jules Koundé on the ball. Opportunity in the wide area. Oh, maybe the equaliser. Can they cover up? Oh, brilliant effort. But the woodwork getting in the way. Well, it's super skilled, Derek. He made such good contact with the ball. He just can't believe he hasn't scored there. And successfully cut out. Mbappe. And Valverde. Attacking possibilities for Real. Well, he certainly wasn't offside by a mile.
Eduardo Camavinga. Look at Modric. The high press was on, and that's a fantastic tackle. Vinicius Jr. Can he play it in? Force. Here's Mbappe. Might it be Mbappe? And a goal! I'll tell you what, they're going to be very hard to catch now. Name on the trophy, maybe. Well, here's the replay. He does well to find that bit of space in the box, and then he shows a lot of composure to finish it off. That's a good goal. So the ball rolling again. 2-0 the score. If you're wondering about stoppage time, one minute to be added on. That is that for the first half here. Forty-five minutes separating these two sides from glory. The second half of the Champions League final begins. Real Madrid doing well to regain possession here. Running with the ball confidently. Nearly had it on the target. Well, it's a good ball in, begging for someone to get on the end of it. Just unable to control the header in the end. Araujo. Under pressure, doesn't seem to be bothering him. Lewandowski. This is looking threatening. Really vital interception. Now veering in field. Can they put it away? Crucial intervention just then amid impending danger. Well, Barca have the ball once more. Kunde. Good movement. Very quick thinking there. De Jong. Lewandowski. Modric. Plenty of support here. Tony Kroos. Vinicius. A goal! That's two for him today. They simply can't stop him. No wonder he's celebrating. Well, just look at his movement. He knows exactly how to find space. And it's also a tidy finish. That's a nice goal. So the action continues and Real very much bossing the proceedings. This might have potential. Can he put it in? 
Oh, good work by the keeper. Gundogan. Read it well. Christensen. Really getting stuck in. Opportunity it is. He'll try his luck here. Well, the shot seemed like a good option, but goalkeeper's ball. Barcelona have given it away. Vinicius Junior. The tackle completely mistimed, and you would expect a booking under the circumstances. And a yellow card for that, Stuart. And he's going to have to be careful now. That was a silly challenge. And into the last 20 minutes. Well, that's how to beat your opponent. Good defending in the end and danger averted for now. Modric. Vinicius. A goal! How about that? He's put it away to make it a hat-trick. Well, this is worth watching again. Mbappe beats the challenge with such ease and then the shot could not be hit any better. Struck with such venom. Great goal. This is turning into something of a rout. 4 0. Rafinha. On to De Jong. Kessier. It's with Joao Cancelo. Given away by Barcelona. Well, close to the end of this contest and Real Madrid absolutely cruising. Stuart, your thoughts? Well, the result has never really been in doubt, has it? They've created so many chances with some brilliant attack in play. I think they've looked an outstanding team today. And the referee says corner kick. Well, they are committed to making the substitution here. And fired over by Kors. Well, as a defender, that will sit you down to the ground. And Bellingham... ...might really be able to trouble them here. Carvajal... ...here's Modric. Oh, fine stop! Corner kick delivery from Toni Kroos. It might still be problematic. Well, the supporters think it's on. Course. Now with Mbappe. And firing it to the near post. Well, in fact, a good but straightforward claim by the keeper. Five minutes left for play. And all pretty decisive. Really good interception. Cross from Danny Carvajal. And well, they can't quite take advantage in the end. Kessier. Here's Rafinha. Joao Felix. Defensive roadblock in the way of that cross. Well, adding up all the stoppages, we will have two extra minutes.
Joao Cancelo. Well, that's how to keep the opposition at bay. Mbappe. And there it is! Real Madrid, Champions League winners! Well, just look at the emotions out there. Joy and relief on one side, despair and heartache on the other. But we've got the right winners here. They fully deserved it on the night. For these players, well, it's the night of their lives and they're determined to enjoy every millisecond. Well, they have to make the most of this, don't they? It's a great feat. What an achievement from them. Well, they don't need to be reminded about what comes next. It's the presentation of the coveted Champions League trophy. Well, there's some tired players out there, but what you can be sure of, they'll find some energy when they get their hands on the trophy. They'll be going mad in the next few moments. The Champions League winners, Real Madrid. Well, this is what they wanted. What a moment for these players. They've worked so hard to win this trophy. They've been fantastic. And you can feel the emotion. It's natural to reflect on this final, but so much hard work has gone into the entire campaign. Memories, memories. What would a celebration be without the chance to enjoy it with your own supporters? Well, these fans have certainly played their part, haven't they? They'll savour these moments. They've travelled far and wide to follow their team. They're loving every minute of this, and why not? They deserve it. A performance of fire as well as ice. They held their nerve when that was necessary. And these celebrations will run long into the night. Well, these are the moments they have to make the most of. It doesn't happen very often, does it? These will be photos to cherish for years to come. Brilliant stuff. And you are looking at the best club side in Europe.